I've always been fascinated by tales of cryptid lake or water monsters, though I've never actually seen one myself. But my grandfather, who for the purposes of this story we'll call Bill, and also a rock-solid no-bullshit man, once recalled a time during World War II when he was serving aboard a ship that was in the English Channel. He noticed a commotion one evening on deck, and when he went to investigate, many crewmen were carrying on. Those who happened to have cameras were eagerly snapping photos, though Bill didn't have a camera. What he claims to have seen was astonishing. A creature was traveling in the water in a perpendicular fashion with the boat. It was moving just slowly enough to frighten the crewmen into thinking that their vessel would collide with the beast. The creature, whose long back broke the water and looked something like a crocodile's, had its head held out of the water as it traveled. Its incredible size was said to even be longer than the vessel itself. My grandfather stared there with his mouth hanging wide open. As he recounted, the vessel and the creature actually did come very close to colliding, but apparently the animal had a clear destination in mind. It simply kept on moving without acknowledging the vessel or looking left or right, luckily for those on board. And it was not seen to submerge. Crew members followed it with their eyes as long as they were able until it finally disappeared from sight. This couldn't have been a crocodile, first of all not in the English Channel, and certainly not one of any significant size. When I pressed him for a better description, he stubbornly gathered his bearings and stated, well, shit, it looked like a dinosaur. That's all there is to it. A goddamn dinosaur, I swear it. And this was especially chilling to me.